All right, uh, we're going to kind of go over the uh, parts of the chromosome, the things that make up its anatomy. As you can see right here, I'm drawing a shape that should probably be familiar to you. It's kind of the X shape that you're familiar with the chromosome. And you'll notice that it's a whole bunch of kind of squiggles a little there. Now, as you see at the bottom right, right here, what I've actually done is I've actually taken those squiggles, and it's almost like a, a shirt where there's a thread on it, and you just pulled out that thread, and you just kept on pulling and pulling and pulling, and so you ended up with kind of like a ball of strain or something like that. So that's what we're looking at for the chromosome. So we got a couple parts right here. That middle part that I'm pointing to right there, that is called the centromere. Now you'll notice at the top I have these two things right here. Each half of the chromosome is called a chromatid. That'll come into play in just a minute right here because when you get that unwound part when it's kind of like that ball of strain, that is called chromatin. So just a few vocab terms. You need to know this is the centromere, the central part. Each half of the, of the chromosome is called the chromatid, and the unwound part is called the chromatin. Now, the entire thing here, what I'm looking at is, of course, a chromosome. Now, here's another diagram that I brought in right here. This one right here kind of has that fuzzy appearance as well. Remember, it's all wound up right here. It's all packed up really tight. And that whole thing is the chromosome. Each half right there, what you're looking at, is a chromatid, and you will notice that they are absolutely identical same each half. Sometimes they are called sister chromatids, though obviously not all sisters are identical. And again, that middle part right there is the centromere. Now I'm going to bring in an actual realistic, uh, or sorry, not even realistic, a real picture of a chromosome right here just to show you those parts again. So uh, again, right there, where you're looking at that middle part is called the centromere. It's kind of where those sister chromatids meet, the joining of them and the X shape there. Each half of them, of course, is the chromatid, and you can see it's labeled here the chromatid and its sister chromatid, and the entire thing, once again, is the chromosome. So, make sure you know these parts, make sure you can identify them and draw them.